This tutorial is about using Query Builder in Laravel. Using Query Builder, you can uh, do crude operation in the MySQL database without using any model. So to start the process, first of all, I will create a controller to do query controller by using this command. Okay, our controller is created. Now open the controller and add the DB class. We don't need any model class here. So add DB class here. And to add the DB class, you have to type just use DB. Okay. Now open the controller to do query controller and add the db class here ok go to step 3 add the route for the to do query index method then web.php Not the routing here. If you type to do query in the URL, it will call the index method of to do list controller. Save all the file. Now go for step 4. Add the public method in the controller with this code. Go to the controller. this is the code here you can see no model is used here and using db class you can retrieve all record from the to do list table and for which loop is used to display the value of the name field of each record save the file and this is the contain of to do list so I have to type here to do query. Okay, our server is not running. So PHP have to some serve. Now again refresh the page. Here you can see the value of these three records are appear next go to step 6 to search record based on id or primary key so add this code here So suppose I will search record 13 so type here 13 and it will retrieve the value of the name field refresh the page and this is the value of 30 next uh, go to this step select particular field from a row or from a table so copy and add this code here suppose I want the description field only and then type here description and it will retrieve the value of the description all description field of the to the list table save the file 
and here also I have to type description now again refresh and these are all the description field or description uh, field value of to the list table and now add this line to execute query as a normal query that we have executed in MySQL so copy this and attach all right in the controller select all from to the list if you want the value then just copy a for loop and paste here so now if I again refresh the page then it will display the name value now how you can insert record using DB class just set this code here to test the code here is the mandatory field in my to-do list table so this way the name description email and uh, there are three fields so the three question mark will be appear here and uh, corresponding to this field the value will be appear in the array now save the file and again refresh the page nothing appear that means data is inserted browse now you can see record 14 is added and uh, next example is to update a particular record here yeah. suppose I will update the record 10 here so that the uh, 10 ID value so update to release set name equal to change where ID equal to 10 again refresh and check the field of this name value and this is change okay and uh, last example is to delete record belt or name or whatever you want name is suppose change then it will remove the record then yes. here is change value is in record 10 so if i execute the method and browse the file browse the table then you will see record 10 is removed in this way you can easily apply code operation in laravel using tv class without any model thank you for watching